Seeing the success of the Marvel Cinematic Universe before the release of Man of Steel, David S. Goyer, the writer and producer who would go on to produce more DC content, says that WB came to them with one demand and forced them to compete with the MCU way ahead of their schedule. David Goyer has done a lot of talking in regards to what went on behind the scenes when he was involved with the DCEU. Now, of course, after the success he found with the Dark Knight films, naturally, they brought him on board. We know that Chris Nolan was involved to some degree, although not a big one. So naturally, he was on hand and he helped bring the DCEU forward. And recently, doing a stint of interviews and uh, more publications talking about some of the things that went on, he revealed that, yeah, once Man of Steel was getting off the ground, about halfway into it, they were like, oh man, look at the MCU, look at what they're doing, look at the success of this big film, look at the Avengers and what it's shaping up to be. And he says multiple voices came in from different departments, different sides, and all wanted the same thing. And instead of going full on with multiple films, which he talked about before, where he said we wanted a Man of Steel 2 at least, we at least wanted a Batman prequel to get things off the ground. They didn't allow that. They literally told them, get to the Avengers as fast as possible, no matter what. And that they literally were telling them, this is what it has to be. And he confirmed that the original rumor, and Zack Snyder alluded to this years ago, was Man of Steel 2 became Batman v Superman literally days before San Diego Comic-Con where it was announced. And if you look at that old announcement and the logo, remember, the logo wasn't even symmetrical. It was off. It was misshaped. It was like somebody just whipped it up before that. And if you guys remember, about a year and a half ago, Zack Snyder and Goyer did separate interviews, and they said they were sitting in a room when they told them, go out there and pitch this entire idea. And they looked at each other and went, what? And Zack Snyder specifically told them, we'd have nothing here in place. There's nothing we can do. And they were like, don't worry about it. We'll figure it out. Just sell people on the idea that we are competing with the MCU and we're coming after them fast. Ultimately, we know what history showed us. And, um, well, we're getting a reboot.